For two decades, Jane Morris and her family have lived on this rural property along the eastern edge of Deland. You can see it's got plenty of wood so her four cats run around safely, and they did until Sunday. She was shot intentionally. From the angle she was shot at, it was intentional. Jane Morris's pet, two-year-old Reese, is recovering at home after an arrow. This arrow, 16, 18 inches long, pierced her body. This is the disturbing picture of Reese before the veterinarian removed the arrow. It came in the front, hit her, I found out later at the vet, it hit her in the shoulder and went through her body, so she was targeted from the front. Morris had just walked outside heading for the store Sunday when the cat ran up on the front porch right past her and collapsed. The arrow missed all of her major organs, which is just, it's a miracle. But Morris says the arrow broke Reese's shoulder bone, and the vet says it's possible she could lose a leg because of it. The family immediately checked the property, didn't see anyone, but they're certain the archer, who used an arrow that says Mission Crossbows, was close because Morris says her cats, including Reese, don't stray far. Now she's concerned about her family's safety, the safety of other pets and people, children in the area. What worries me is they start with cats, what are they going to do next? Of course, Ms. Morris is working with animal control, but she's so adamant about identifying the person who attacked her cat, she is offering a $200 reward for information. Near DeLand, Volusia County, Claire Matzwesh, 2 News.